PC video, do you want, are you bored of little, little, little tables with fences and flash pressure plates? Are you bored of trying to sit in chairs that look like chairs, aka stairs? Well, perfect amount for you. Look at this. All these selections. Go buy. Go get your furniture. Because some of these are very expensive. It's like commercial, isn't it? That's not like a commercial. Woo! Um. Well, anyways, this is Mr. Mr. Crayfish's furniture mod, and actually, this is a very big mod in my opinion. It actually has a lot of stuff. So first up, I'm just gonna. The crafting the recipes will be in the form page. I'll leave, the, leave a link in the description to that to download and stuff. Um, but and um, all the how to download mods and stuff. Anyways, let's get started. Um, so yeah. first, what we're gonna check out is the um, table. So uh, there's wooden and stone ones. Um, as you can see, there are tables, and can you actually put stuff on it? Uh, uh, actually, let's try to put something on it. Um, let's just put some food cake. Now, actually, you can put, yeah, can you put cake on that? I don't know too much about this mod here. Let's see if we can actually put cake on here. This will be a lovely. Yay, you actually could. That's cool. What about, like, other food? Okay, whatever, forget it. Um, now, I did a little distract. So, there's some stone... And actually, let's just get out some of my other stuff. Anyway, let's go. And the chair, right click, and you actually sit in it. How do I look? How do I look? Okay, cool. I am on a chair, and I think you, um, shift, click shift, get off, I think, shift, and there we go. And, um, yeah, there's stone version, and once again, the coffee table. There we go. Oh gosh. There we go. Um, yeah. So the coffee table, same thing. You can place. I, I believe you can place cake. Oh, it's hovering. We have floating cake. Yeah, why not? Okay. So next up, well, you can be a couch potato by sitting on your favorite couches. So let's get them. Um, it's actually not on a computer. Um, there's a TV here. Where is it? I'm gonna get rid of this. Um, I, th okay, where's the TV? TV, TV, TV. There it is. Um, so, the TV is very cool. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, so you're the one that has to go away. Bye. Um, so the TV is, I like how it looks. Yeah, yeah, it looks very good. As I hold it, I never know if it's strong enough to hold the TV. I think, yeah. Oh, it's hovering. Yeah, you can have a hovering TV. It's magic, guys. That's awesome. Okay, so place down your table. And then you actually, uh, I believe it's a right click. Yeah, it's a right click, right click. You have a lot of TV shows. Look at this. Very interesting, isn't it? Let's right click here. Right click the couch. Now you're on a couch, being a couch potato, watching some TV. Oh, they have Nye and Cat. Cool, look at this. Oh, this is the best TV show. I'm just kidding. Okay, so next, and we have no time to waste. Okay, I didn't believe we can get two couches together. For some reason, black and smooth, but whatever. I don't care. I think you can actually, um, gosh, okay, that's not good. Um, I think, I believe, you can put couches, like, next to each other. To, yeah, look at this. Look at this. We're going to make the, oh, we're making the longest couch in the world. And, um, with two couches match. Awesome, look at this! Look at this couch! Oh, this is awesome, guys. Oh, and we're gonna try to test out a curve as well. It's be cool. I'm a bit distracted, but who cares? Okay, there we go. Yes, it works! Also, we can have, like, the longest couch. We'll be creative, and I might have, like, a, like a modded survival or something. That might be quite cool. I have the furniture mod, definitely, and make the longest one. And next up, we're checking out the cabinet, or bed drawer, or whatever. You can actually store stuff in it. Acts like a chest, but with very less stuff. We gotta store stuff. This is a cabinet. It looks like a wood. Wait, no, I think it's because it's in a different direction. Yeah, see? Like a little handle to it, and you can actually store more stuff. Let's just put my TV, uh, my couch. Oh, gosh. 
Okay, okay, my couch. Let's just pop some stuff in there. Stuff that we don't really need. Okay, so the next, we're checking out some of the. Uh, this is a really cool feature. So this is called the electric fence. It's really cool. It's actually good for protecting. Put it around your house, and actually nothing will come because. Um. If we hop over to survival, actually, if you hit this, you see this? You see this? You see this? It hurts you. That's very good. So if a zombie tries to attack you, it gets elect electrified in this thing. So sensors anything that lives and it kills them. Let's just test it out. Let's test it out on a poor little um, skeleton. Yeah, let's just go with a spider. Okay, we'll test it out on a spider. Spider. So let's go. Okay, come on, spawn the spider right here. See, see, he dies. It's very cool. So the electric fence is a very cool feature. Okay, next we're ch okay. Clicking the wrong. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Um. So basically, this is a very fun thing to mess around with. Troller trolling. And many others. Actually, you can actually use this for trolling, this electric fence. Yeah, why not? Okay, so we have more to review. So next we are going for um the next we're uh, next we are gonna check out some of the uh, the things for a kitchen related stuff. So kitchen related stuff I think cook flesh and flesh. These are bleed cooked from rotten flesh, which you cook. I think um, you have mailbox, hammers, um, very cool stuff that I might not have time to go over. I'm just going to go over some of them, and you can um, explore it yourself. The one. Look at this texture. That looks awesome. Okay, so the oven, you can actually smelt nine stuff at once. And I think, I believe, for crafting recipe, you need... Eight blocks of iron around a furnace. So sorry, I don't have, I don't have that. But yeah, I remember. I, I remember. I remember it. Oh gosh, I have wrong button. Okay, so right click and um. Oh yeah, no, no. Then no, you put like rotten flesh. I think it was like coal or something. You toss rotten flesh in this freezer. I think it was, and then you actually get uh, your flesh, which I believe is eatable without even having food poisoning. Okay, so stereos. The doorbell is quite cool. Let's actually get a block. We'll just. Well, let's get my case of wood. And um, we will actually try this out. There we go. So we have our doorbell. Oh, wait, no. We need our doorbell, don't we? Okay, doorbells. So the doorbell, I think, was a note block with redstone or something. Right? Uh, you actually right click. <laughs> it has this nice doorbelly sound you know Gosh, okay, i'm breaking everything cool so that is that well, i'm sorry i'm not the best mod reviewer i mean okay so basically i think what are what, what can we check out next what else do we have uh, we'll check out the bird bath and so oh, this path is quite cool let's just check that out This is awesome. You can now you can use like better stuff. So that's that. Um, here we go. Uh, moving on, let's go for the toilet. Why not the toilet and the sink? We'll go with the bathroom stuff. So where's the? Oh gosh, I don't know where it is. I have no idea where it is. Oh, there we go. We have more stuff. So the cabinet, we have a bath, a shower. So the shower head, yeah, that's cool. A bin, a trash can, and some presents, some Christmas trees. Quite cool. So the toilet, let's see how it looks. Oh. Press F for farts. Gosh. Please don't try this. I mean, it's a little gross, though. If you sit on the toilet, you press F, it makes its farting noise. Um, which, it's true. I'm not trying to be inappropriate or anything. Yeah, but that's the toilet. 
Oh, they added the very inappropriate stuff. Okay, not really too much. But anyway, um, moving on, let's just... Uh, this is the sink. You need to have a water source under the block. The basin is... That makes no sense. You can use a water bucket to fill it. So, yeah, I guess you would take a water bucket. So, let's do that. Okay, so let's do this right click. Bam, look at this. Okay, so moving on to the trash can. Bing, and then you toss stuff that you don't need. So, for ex instance, you toss some stuff that you don't want. Uh, for example, if you have like a bleeding sword and it gives you like a stack of, no, I'm just kidding, like, like a crazy amount of stuff, then you can actually toss some in here and actually, and then click empty, bye bye gone there we go now the shower i believe is this is how you do it so in the shower you take the shower head or no maybe not how do we do this it's like right click or something okay well that's the sh that's that um the bath well, let's go with the bath okay we need a, a little bit of room for this one i guess and i believe we fill it up with water bucket once again bam oh nope it's filling it's filling Yay, we filled the bath. Let's hop in. Okay, so that, those are that. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? Curtains, blinds, ovens. We have, yeah, th those um, only fit in walls if you want it. Like, other than having, like, the window, you can put that. Um. And you have mailboxes, which you can put in front of your house to have, you know, people, like, um, oops, there you go, um, basically, uh, so you're gonna right-click, there's six storage areas, that's okay, and that's pretty much all, no, well, you can go ahead and explore yourself, but anyways, that's pretty much all that I just wanted to show you. Oh, the flam. This is a cool one. Okay, so it has to be, has to be placed on a bedside cabinet. So let's do that. That's how they teach us stuff. So go ahead and explore yourself as well. I'm not going to show you everything. Bed drawer. That's a bed drawer. Where's the best side cabinet? Is this one? Is this it? There you go. No? I believe you shift and right click. Oh, there you go. You shift and right click. Shift and right click on the cabinet. And then it places it, I think. Yeah, it does. Cool. And then what do you do? Turn it on. Turn it off. That's cool. So cool. Go ahead and explore this mod yourself. It's a pretty cool mod um, that I've it's really good and finally i want to thank you all very much for watching and i will see you all later half a heart that's close anyways thanks for watching and i will see you all next time bye